Hey everyone. All right, apologies for the audio again. Um, you know, just using my headphone mic again, but this is a, a really quick tip tutorial just to kind of piggyback off of my 3D coat tutorial for texturing. So when you go through that workflow, and this, this applies to all kinds of stuff, um, it places the textures that it picks somewhere in a shared folder on your hard drive that both 3D coat and Blender can see. Um, if you don't want to go hunting for those textures here's a really quick tip to just put them where you want them okay um, so we have our project here and it's saved and I have it saved in this folder skull project v2 so if you just want to copy those textures and and put them somewhere that you can easily easily access them all you have to do is go to external data under the file menu and pack resources and that copies all of the texture files into your blender file right now, if you want to put them on your hard drive, just go to File, External Data, Unpack Resources. You have a bunch of options here. We'll just choose the first one. And what that does is it creates a folder right next to where your Blender file is saved. And all of your textures are in there. So that's an easy way to access all of the textures that 3D Coat created for your object. And this works for anything. It's not, you know... Uh, specific to the 3D coat workflow. Anytime you want to get your textures into a place that you can easily find them on your hard drive, just do that. Pack and then unpack. All right, see you next time. Bye.